Hello there, Gemini. Welcome. This is your January 2023 reading. Let's see what's going on for you for this new year. What's coming in for you guys? Let's see. What do we have here? Okay, we do have a Knight of Coins, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have the Wheel of Fortune. And... We have the Emperor. Ooh. Nice. Okay, so someone's coming towards you really slow. Divine, divine timing. Destiny. Someone might feel like you're their destiny. Okay, and the Emperor. That could be your energy or it could be someone coming towards you. Let's see what you have going on here. We have the Justice. Justice is coming in. Libra energy. Okay, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Aries. Let's get a charm for the night. What do we have here? Oh, see, now they're... Oh, I thought this was a snail. Actually, it's a very intricate heart. This person is... This feels like there's a love that's very complicated and very deep. Get a, um... Right here. Coming towards you. In divine timing, your destined be together. This also could be... This could be an offer coming in. Could be a love offer. Could also be a business offer. There is justice coming in. Let's see what else we get on so we can get a better idea what's going on here. Okay, so why is the Knight of Coins here? Why is the Knight of Coins here for Gemini? Ah, this person's coming in with a lot of emotions, a lot of love for you, overflowing with love. Okay, get ready. Here they come. What about the Wheel here? Why is the Wheel of Fortune here? Okay, this is someone coming back around. The World card. Complete a cycle, come back in again. And what about um, the Emperor? Why do we have the Emperor here? What's going on with the Emperor? Could be dealing with the Aries, but let's see. Ah, trying to make a decision here. So, yeah, you could be dealing with a far, um, Earth sign, or you could be dealing with an Aries. Still not sure if this is your energy or someone else's. Someone is confused about making a decision or doesn't have the answers here. Hmm. But moving away from something to something better. This is moving on. This is, um, this also could be a travel card. Are you planning on taking a trip? This could be a trip. Could be a vacation holiday. Okay, let's get some more here. Do we have the justice coming in here? To get a better idea on that. I, I'm not getting anything. I'm asking about the emperor and then my guys, the angels, are not telling me anything. So we'll leave it be for now to see what happens. Okay, let's see. The Magician. Whoa. And we have the Moon. Wow. And we have the Ten of Wands. Knight, uh, King of Cups. King of Cups is Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces energy. Okay, now someone might be manifesting something. You could be manifesting something here with the Magician. For me, the Magician is Aries and Aquarius energy. But the most people think it's, um, most people feel as Gemini or Virgo. So take it how it resonates with you. But here we have this magician. So this is you manifesting anyway. Manifesting something new here. And you might be doing this on the download here. You're not letting other people know. There's some kind of burden that is, is ready to leave for you. You're going to be finished with something here. Okay, let's see. Why do we have the magician here? Why is the magician here? There's some kind of argument or fights or competition for something here. And the moon card. Why is the moon card here? A celebration. Getting together. Some kind of celebration. What's going on here? Why do we have... Are you hiding? There's like a get together. Maybe you're getting together with someone here. And you're not... You're keeping it very quiet. You're not... You don't want other people to know. Because it's a burden for them to know something here. If, especially if you're returning to someone from the past, you might be keeping it quiet. You manifested this. Yes, there's an opportunity coming in here. Ace of Pentacles. That's going to take care of your burdens. If you've been having um, a hard time with finances, that is going to be over. Because the burdens are over and the Ace of Pentacles is replacing it. There's an ending here. A major ending. 
ending, new beginning, a major transformation is what I should say. Scorpio energy. A big change coming in for you guys. Okay. Could have something to do with this King of Cups too. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces energy. Let's see this one ends up being on the table here. Let's see. Wow, Ten of Cups. There's a lot of happiness coming. King of Wands and the Queen of Cups. Holy moly. And justice again. There's definitely justice coming in for you guys. Okay, now for the um, Ten of Cups, there's emotional happiness here coming in. Something, this ending, this burden ending, the money coming in is bringing you a lot of happiness. Now for this King, okay, someone might be flying towards you. King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Or traveling towards you or you're taking a trip with this person what about this Queen of Cups let's see this is a Scorpio Cancer Pisces energy we have here okay we have a bull here Taurus energy too all right um Queen of Cups okay yeah so there's um it's a lot of emotions here Look at the Ten of Cups with the Queen of Cups. There's definitely a lot of emotions coming in. Okay, let's see. Why is the Ten of Cups here? Why is the Ten of Cups here? Ah, the Empress. See, that's the... This, I think, is your energy here. You're coming... This is an Emperor coming towards you, but not knowing how to approach you. Okay, I knew I was going to figure it out later, but the Empress had to come up because this is you being in your really happy in your home life your family life uh, might also be um someone might be pregnant here but this is also giving birth to something new but this is one of the most abundant cards in the deck the empress new job a new business what about this king of wands who's this king of wands someone from your past coming back in here Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. A lot of memories here. Okay, what about this Queen of Cups? I feel like this is your energy, but let's see. What else we get on it? Ah, yes. This is your energy. And this is someone that wants a commitment here. Happy home life. This person's coming in. Wanting a happy home life. Wanting to come back in from the past here. Coming in with the Knight of Cups. So they're coming in with a love offer here. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. Let me get a charm on this one. And we have here, well, a salamander, a lizard. This could be someone shed their skin. They they might be come back and saying they changed. I mean, take it. If it might be true, might not. That also, it's the salamanders are protection. The person might be coming in to protect you too. Hmm. Okay. Let me put this over here. But there's justice coming in for you. Let's get some more information going on here. Let's see what else is going on for Gemini. What else is going on? The chariot. Something's coming in quick. Cancer energy. Fast movement. And we have the star. Okay. Aquarius energy. And we have the hermit. I don't know. Something's coming in here quick, real quick that you might become... A solo artist or something like that. I'm feeling like this by yourself. You're becoming famous. But it's happening very quick here. It's not like you're in a group. It's something you're doing on your own. Okay, let's see. What else do we have here? The Herm uh, so we have Cancer, Aquarius, and um, Virgo. What else do we have? So here's the Four of Wands. The Seven of Pentacles and Justice again. You're, you know, th this is a long time coming. Something might have prevented this from happening before. Also, you have this commitment here. There is a solid commitment coming in, and there, you're going to harvest a lot here that's going to bring you justice. What else do we have here with Gemini? This is a long time coming, though. We've been waiting for this. There was a painful ending. But something had to balance out here. 
and now a divine timing destiny things are working in place but you had to end something first there's something may, maybe you were doing two jobs or, or trying to um juggle two things so you had to end one and now things are changing for your favor judgment here something's coming back around some kind of judgment okay let's go over on this side now and see what else we got for you guys what else is coming in for Gemini? What else? The Empress again. Libra Taurus energy. Nine of Wands. I feel like, like I don't know if this makes any sense to you, but I feel like someone's defending you that you left out in the cold. Someone that you left behind is defending you from something. Ace of Wands, a lot of passion, desire here. Some new beginning, new start. Someone's coming in with a love offer or two want to stay together. And it might be something to do with work. A soulmate connection. Something to do with your work. But we have here, Page of Cups is Scorpio Cancer Pisces energy. And we have here, yeah, a leaf. Someone might say they're turn, they turned over a new leaf. I think this is person that's protecting you. They're coming in and they might be working with you somehow or seeing you again at work meeting meeting you again at work maybe you met them at work and now you're back together or they're coming where you work may they left there or you left there or someone left and maybe you come back together it seems like you're meeting up again okay let's see what else we have here for gemini what else okay nine of pentacles Two of Wands. Ooh, the Ace of Swords. Someone, this person's coming in here to speak their truth. Queen of Pentacles. I see you as a Queen of Pentacles. You have this um, Knight of Pentacles come back in to speak their truth. You are focusing on your money, on your career, on your business here. I think you're becoming famous here. This card over here. Star and the Hermit. Okay, Taurus Virgo Capricorn. Let's just go on with this. And we have a shell. Something about the ocean, the sea. A shell. Listening here. Hearing something. I could always think of this conch shell of how, you know, you listen to it and you can hear the ocean. So you might be listening to something at the ocean because of the ocean. Or you're hearing something because of this. Okay, Knight of Pentacles. Taurus Virgo Capricorn. You have a couple people interested in you. And uh, they're coming in with some passion here. And apologies and... I don't know. You affected a lot of people, it seems like. And here we have the Queen of Pen Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capital. But this is your energy. Focusing on your career. Focusing on your money. Doing well with it. And we have here the fish. You're going to be very abundant. Money's coming in for you. The fish card here. Wow. Okay, yeah, definitely we have, and this is one of the most abundant cards, the, the Empress. Of course, you have the Empress. So I think you're meeting your match, too. There's a power couple coming together. But you have other people interested in you, too. It might be a little complicated. Okay, let's see what the word is. What's the word for you? Let's start with this Knight of Pentacles that comes in the very beginning. That has a lot of love for you. Let's see. We have lust, present, thinking. Okay, in the present, this person is thinking in a very lustful way when they come towards you. Just so you're aware. What about this page of cups? We have hidden, finish, Okay, maybe someone was hiding that they're married, so now they're finished hiding that. Or so it's hidden, finished, finished, married. Or maybe someone's finished being married and that, and they hid that from you. Take it how it works for you, because it might be different. It might come out different ways for different people. But this is yeah, this is saying we got hidden, we have finished, and we have married. So we can rearrange it how it makes sense to you. Now let's see here. We have the King of Wands. Now with this king of wands. 
we have here phone call sincere okay expect a sincere phone call from this person at a distance this king of wands okay now what about this queen of cups which i feel like is your energy we have freedom okay alone freedom sex okay maybe someone wants to get you alone to have the freedom to have sex okay um let's see let's get this knight of pentacles what's going on with this knight of pentacles we have surprise talk karma drama okay so someone's going to surprise you with their talk about karma and drama they might be going through something here okay what about this queen of pentacles we have here desire a shocking tower here separate okay so there's going to come in some kind of surprise some kind of change about someone having a desire for you Aries Scorpio energy with the tower what about this knight of cups we have here memories closure past life so someone has memories and they they might have went through and got a um, hypnotized or something and found out there's this past life with you there's memories and they want to have closure on something they need closure okay let's see what signs could we be dealing with now I think am I missing any um I guess we have no court cards over here make sure I'm not missing okay we have Libra Scorpio Capricorn Pisces oh, two together Aries Leo just fix these a little better I kind of need room for that one and Virgo oops oh and Leo want to show again so Leo's oh Leo keeps on popping whoa Leo doesn't want to go away okay you have a very um very forceful Leo here that really wants to be in the picture here okay so so here we have so this could be placed in your chart placement other people's chart past present and future Libra Scorpio Capricorn Pisces Aries Leo and of course another Leo there and Virgo now let's do the letters we're gonna do 11 letters for initials first name last name if you get both the first and last name and someone has a middle name and you know the middle name you get that initial also all the better past present and future and also your own initials we have O D C M A X we have max here F K S P G okay so letters we have for you today are O D C M A X F X S P G now let's see what names want to come out what are the names here for Gemini what are the names the bottom. okay we have Lisa Marie we have Stavian S-T-A-I-V-E-N Cat K-A-T Jeanette J-E-A-N-E-T-T-E -T -T -E. Neil Miriam M-I-R-I-A-M -I -I Heather oops I just knocked over this one here Heather okay Chanel C-H-A-N-N-E-L-L -L, Ashish A-S-H-I-S-H -S -S Jordan Lauren L O U R E N and Nathaniel. So we have 12. Okay, those are the names. Now remember guys, 
These are general readings. They are not personal readings. Please just take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Please let me know if it resonates. Please leave comments. I love to read your comments. Um, and if it um, does not resonate, check out your other placements, your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. And if it does resonate, you can still check out your other placements and put them all together. I just changed the G to L here. So if you need, oh, I'm flipping them all over the place here. Okay, guys. So, um, yeah, so you could check out your other placements too and put them all together and get a bigger picture. All right, guys, I love you so much, and I appreciate all you like, share, subscribe, and comments. And I hope to see you all again real soon. Thank you.